you guys were able to put together. What did you feel out there? Um, you know, we made big plays when we needed to. We felt like, uh, you know, they're being a lot better at getting to those 50-50 balls and being scrappy. But, um, you know, they're a type of team that keeps coming at you. They're shooting the ball extremely well from three. Um, you know, they were getting downhill and getting to the bucket. And, um, you know, we just made really big plays when we needed to. And we were resilient there at the end and we're scrappy. So I think overall that was very telling for us down the stretch. Nine games to go. As you guys continue to build towards the postseason, when it comes to taking that one-on-one -on -one challenge, what has to be better? How do you get there? Um, you know, we just need, need to uh, trust each other, know uh, when to help, not, not um, over help on certain plays, and then learn where and, uh, when and where to take fouls and um, you know, time and score, uh, really on both ends, uh, figuring out. Um, just playing smart basketball and making the right plays, but we felt like we, we had done that this week. Uh, today was just one of those um, ugly games you just have to get over the top of and, and make big plays, and we did that, but we, we definitely have to be better on the one-on-one -on -one, uh, challenge, as you said. Kevin, uh, they, talked to you a little bit, or they talked to us a little bit today about you cutting more to the hoop. Um, is, that, is, this, is this kind of a new wrinkle to how you're being used? <laughs> Uh, maybe a little bit. It's just uh, there was a time out there today where um, I think I shot two threes open the half right away, and I probably should have drove the ball and or you know, passed it and cut and uh, you know, drove to the hoop and tried to get it back. But um, no, I just uh, as I mentioned, just try to make the right play and, and kind of find myself out there with with uh, you know, a lot of new bodies and new guys getting back. Kevin, coach said that your presence was what the team needed at this point of the season. What type of presence do you try to bring to the court, to the locker room, to the team? Um, just, uh, I've been here, it's my fourth year here, so just bringing a uh, consistency with this team and a familiar face that um, you know, can fit pretty seamlessly or fit pretty seamless in what we're trying to do. So um, I think more than anything, that's it. Just another healthy body getting out there and uh, you know, fitting well with this team. The other night you were doing the backstroke along the sideline. I think you said you were just having fun. Today you chest bumped the stanchion. Yeah. <laughs> what goes into those those antics for well, you? I went in. You know, I'm just uh, enjoying the game. I mean, if uh, I guess I was out there when uh, you know I fell on the floor after Henson um, fouled me uh, and I did the backstroke. But um, no, today was just uh, it was, I wasn't out there for the Portland game. Um, you know, when Braun had the dunk over Nurkic, but um, I was out there today, and uh, I was just having fun with it. It was fun, fun to see. I love that type of play, and um, I don't know if they caught it on. Uh, they did. On TV. Okay, well there you go. I'll be looking at it then. It'll be fun to watch. How much more progress do you think this team can make until the playoffs and then through the playoffs as well? Yeah, I think uh, you know if we lock in, we're a very tough team to beat, and I think there is there is uh, we say it every year, but I think there is progress we can make here the last 10 or so games and um, you know find places where we can we can get better but um, well, LeBron has it going but the way he right from the start today do you amaze he doesn't ever kind of say I'm, you know, I'm going to force it because my offense is there he kind of keeps everyone involved anyway or does he ever do it uh, it's just that's just who he is. His makeup is to uh, you know just go out there and, and make the right play, play you know excellent basketball. He always is trying to get us involved while making sure he asserts his dominance on the offensive end, whether that's scoring uh, the basketball, um, you know, getting an extra possession on the offensive glass, or uh, always being a distributor. So he's he's special. Kevin, you guys have always played as a top seed. This season you'll be playing as a lower seed. Is there um, what's the difference in that for, for the team and what kind of adjustments would you have to make? Uh, only difference would be you know, whether we start at home or away from home but uh, you know, we've been the second seed before and you know, started the Eastern Conference Finals away from away from home so um, I don't know, just uh, got a good mindset.